Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews, and it's 12, 12 p.m., and it's Sunday, December 19th, 2021. Anyway, yesterday I went to my local grocery store, Homeland, and I got this. Um, They had three of the four flavors. They had another flavor, but they were sold out of it, so I had to get that one some other time to review it. But um, anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing a coffee drink. Anyway, this is the Espresso with Cream Black Rifle Coffee Company Coffee Drink. So, oh yeah, boys, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, I could have reviewed this one for a while, I just haven't did it yet, so you know what I mean? But um, I've seen someone was wanting me to review these, you know what I mean? But um, anyway, that was like, um, actually about a month ago, I seen someone left a comment or something, telling me they wanted to, me to review these, but you know what I mean, but I will. But I mean, it has, over t has a silver top with a silver tab. The bottom is a Best Buy date and production code. Best Buy November 20th, 2022. So it's still fresh for almost a year. And this was like, um, these are on sale for two for $5. So like $2.50 each. They're a little bit more expensive than that, though, when they weren't on sale. So you know what I mean? Um, so yeah, they could be a little bit cheaper, but you know what I mean? I guess okay price. On the top it says good source of protein, 100% Colombian coffee. Has the same thing again. Veteran owned Black Rifle Coffee Company, BRCC, which means the Black Rifle Coffee Company, you know. Espresso with cream, America's coffee, and has American flag. 200 milligrams of caffeine. So, oh yeah, boys, it will get you lit. It will get you lit, you know, just saying it has 200 milligrams of caffeine. So, oh yeah, boys, oh yeah, oh yeah. 11 fluid ounces, 325 milliliters, gluten-free. Has like a camo um, design background pattern. Looks pretty cool with the green and the dark black and the dark brown. Looks pretty cool, you know, just saying. Um, but yeah. Okay. The military veterans at Black Rifle Coffee Company had developed this kick-ass espresso with cream that is a blend of espresso, milk, protein, and caffeine to help dominate your day. Serving suggestion, best served chilled or over ice, refrigerated after opening. Produced in the United States from domestic and imported ingredients. Joy by date on can, please recycle, and some recycling stuff. Prou proudly distributed by Black Rifle Coffee Company, 1144 South 500 West, um, Salt Lake City, Utah, 84101. As SKU, the ball logo, and some other codes. Nutrition facts, one serving per container. Serving size 11 fluid ounces, 325 milliliters. Amount per serving, calories 170. Total fat, 2 grams, 3%. Saturated fat, 1.5 grams, 8%. Trans fat, 0 grams. Cholesterol, 10 milligrams, 3%. Sodium, 220 milligrams, 10%. Target carbohydrates, 30 grams, 11%. Dietary fiber, 1 gram, 4%. Total sugars, 23 grams, includes 14 grams added sugars, 28%. Protein, 7 grams, 14%. This so actually has a good amount of protein in it. Not as much as like those protein waters or protein shakes though, see so you know what I mean? Vitamin D, 0 micrograms, 0%. Iron, 0 milligrams, 0%. Vitamin A, 130 micrograms, 15%. Vitamin E, 2 milligrams, 15%. Calcium, 247 milligrams, 20%. Potassium, 472 milligrams, 10%. Vitamin C, 29 milligrams, 30%. Okay, then it has the other ingredients. It has Colombian brewed coffee, which is filtered water and coffee. Low-fat milk, non-fat ultra-filtered milk. Has a chicory root fiber and cellulose gel, cocoa processed with alcohol high, cellulose gum, it has the caffeine and carrageenan, and it has, yeah, and the vitamins and stuff, contains milk, gluten free, it has the U in the circle, www.blackriflecoffeecompany-club, um, so yeah, that's pretty much the entire can, so I'll let you see right quick. Also, it has the Black Rifle Coffee Company logos, like, little in the background, so that's interesting too. Um, but yeah, anyway, I'll let you see the can right quick. I already showed you the top and the bottom. Yeah, this is the original espresso with cream flavored one. My next review, I think I'm reviewing the mocha flavored one. So stay tuned for that review. I don't know if there's other flavors or not, because um, I can only find four flavors. So just reviewing the ones that I can find, you know. I 
I don't know if any of you are like Lady Gaga fans or whatever, but um, um, her unreleased songs text you pictures finally leaked today after 10 years. Also another song, Eris leaked, so you know what I mean? So that was cool to wake up to, I guess. For me anyway. Okay, here's the nutrition facts. And also, I got a Wacom drawing tablet at Best Buy like two nights ago, because on their sale ended yesterday. So I got a drawing tablet now. I'm gonna start using it, you know. Probably do some Instagram posts with it and stuff. Um, but yeah, I'm probably gonna shot off a YouTube video too. But you know what I mean? But I mean, well, that's pretty much the entire can. I'm gonna shake it up a little bit. I don't want to shake it up too much, you know, because it's an espresso drink, but um, anyway, I'm going to open it, taste it, and get my review for it, so hold on a minute. Okay, I opened it, and the color is basically like a normal coffee drink color, you know. Try to pour some out the top without spilling it on my white shirt, you know. Don't want to stain it. Um, but yeah, it's like a dark brown color. Looks like your stereotypical like coffee drink. Sorry about my lighting though, because I'm parked in the shade. But um, it's a little bit lighter though in real life. I tell you know, because in the shade it's a little bit darker, but still like a lightish brown coffee color. I don't know if you could see it inside or not, but it was frothy. Uh, probably not gonna be able to see it. Maybe a little bit. Um, um but yeah. Anyway, the smell. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Well, definitely an espresso um smell. Very strong coffee scent. Um, a little bit like black coffee, but um sweeter though, because you know it's espresso, but um it's espresso with cream, so you know has a little bit of a sweeter smell though. Like normal espresso, you know, but I'm um, anyway. It smells like um those Starbucks espresso drinks I've had before. And like um very similar smelling to that high brew coffee that I reviewed before. Um Yep, I reviewed a high brew coffee like espresso drink before. This smells just like that. Has that same like dark um dark um very strong rich espresso type of scent. Um, it's not too sweet, but, um, still a little sweet, though. Um, definitely smells like other espresso drinks that I've had before. Nothing too interesting, you know, so you want to mean, but, um, anyway. It'd probably be a good breakfast drink, you know, a good way to start your day, because it has 200 milligrams of caffeine, so it'll definitely give you a good boost, you know. So, oh yeah, boys, you know. So, oh yeah, oh yeah. But, um, yeah, it definitely smells like, like other, like espresso drinks I've had before. Nothing too interesting. Um, but, um, anyway, now I'm going to try it, so here goes. Smooth, a little creamy. You could probably chug the can if you want to, but um, I'm not gonna do that though. I'm actually probably gonna drink like less than half the can right now. So just drink some Pepsi and stuff, if you want me, but um, anyway. Yep, it tastes like other espresso coffee drinks that I've had before. It tastes like the Starbucks espresso drinks and like the high brew coffee, you know, espresso drinks. It tastes just like those, nothing too different. Has a little bit of a creamier taste because, you know, it's the espresso with cream. Um, a little bit of a sweeter um, espresso taste, but um, it doesn't taste um, too different, though, than, like, other espresso drinks that I've had before. Tastes pretty similar, you know. Um, just, you know, so, you know, it's espresso and um, coffee, so it has that same, like, similar type of flavor, you know. Definitely a strong, rich flavor. Definitely go good with, like, pancakes or French toast or waffles or, you know, donuts. Be a good way to start your day, too, you know, because it has the 200 milligrams caffeine. So, oh, yeah, boys, it will get you lit. So, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Um, but, yeah, the flavor is good. But um, I actually like it better than, like, the high-brew coffee drinks because um, one of the high-brew coffee drinks I reviewed is just, um, like, a dark espresso type of flavor. Didn't really have the cream in it, you know, so it was a little bit stronger tasting than this. This is definitely more sweeter tasting, but I'm um, definitely prefer like flavored coffee drinks still over this though. 
like um, vanilla or caramel like mocha coffee drinks, but um, it's still okay though for like an original like coffee espresso type of flavor. See what I mean? I've seen some people online didn't really like these um black rifle coffee drinks, but I'm actually like this. Actually, is a pretty good uh, espresso flavor. See what I mean? Um, but yeah, it doesn't taste too unique though. Um, tastes like other espresso drinks. See what I mean? But um, if you had those, you're probably definitely gonna know what this tastes like. Um, see what I mean? But um, anyway, it has a cool can design. I like the colors of it and stuff with the camo, with the camouflage. It has a pretty cool background pattern design. So, you know, it looks pretty cool. Um, I guess it's okay price. is on sale for two for five dollars, but um, about two fifty a can. But um, it's a little bit more expensive though if it wasn't on sale. So yeah, I think it should definitely be a little bit cheaper. Um, I guess okay price for like a coffee drink though. But yeah, energy-wise, it has 200 milligrams of caffeine, so all oh, yeah, boys will definitely get you lit. So I'd say energy-wise, it doesn't have any of the B vitamins, but, um... <sighs> still say energy-wise, it lasts about, um... Four and a half to about six hours of energy. So all oh, yeah, boys, it'll still get you lit. So all oh, yeah, boys, all oh, yeah, all oh, yeah, all oh, yeah, all oh, yeah. Yeah, I'd say energy-wise, it lasts about four and a half hours, about six hours of energy. Um, it tastes good. Energy wise, it works good. It has a cool can design. It could be a little bit cheaper, but you know, it's still pretty good though. Um, but yeah, it tastes just like other espresso drinks that I've had before. Nothing too interesting. See what I mean? But I still think it's actually pretty good though. See what I mean? But yeah, I'm going to give the original espresso with cream, Black Rifle Coffee Company coffee drink. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, it's lit. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. Oh yeah. So yeah, definitely try it if you can find it. It's actually a pretty good espresso with cream coffee drink. Um, but yeah, it doesn't taste too unique though, but, um, still pretty good though. So yeah, energy-wise it works good. It has a cool can design. It tastes good. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, it's lit. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. Oh yeah. And anyway, in my next review, I'm going to be reviewing the Mocha flavored one of these. Stay tuned for that review. So I'm going to review some more videos. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out. And bye.